book. I know it sounds like a great big cliche, but time really is a healer. I promise you, you will meet someone else one day very soon. I don't want anybody else. I want Tom. What exactly happened between the two of you? I don't know. Really? Really. I genuinely don't know. We've been together for two years. Everything was going great. And then last week, he told me it was all over. No explanation. Nothing. That doesn't sound like Tom. And now he's with Jude. It doesn't make any sense. Tom's never liked her that much. Well, it appears he does now. I don't believe that. Can't tell you the number of times he asked me to ditch her. And I always ended up defending her. Uh, you and Judah friends? Where? We shared a room together in first year and been hanging together ever since. That's nice. Tom gave it to me about a month after we started going out. That was lovely. It's trash. I don't know why I'm still wearing it. Look, I know you're hurting now. But honestly, these things happen when you're young. You have got loads of time to date plenty of boys. Why didn't you talk to me? Tell me what was going on. It's driving me crazy. You can't just let him go and put it down to experience. Sorry, I'm gonna... Sorry, I'm gonna have to get that. But listen, stay as long as you want. Hello again, Tom. You all right? Yeah. No. Look, it's none of my business, but what exactly happened between you and Polly? Nothing, really. It's just, you know... No, I don't know. I just didn't work out. You know you broke her heart. Don't you think you at least owe it to her to explain why? Well, isn't it obvious? I'm with Jude now. Oh. You don't seem very happy about it. Well, it's complicated. Well, I better... Valerie. She's blackmailing me. Good night, possums. Emma, let's find somewhere quiet and sit down. OK. Have you heard about SA Mill websites? They are firms that offer students tailor-made essays on any subject for a fee. They'll write the essay for you. So it's cheating? Well, it's a good way of improving your grade. Everyone wants to leave uni with a 2-1 at least. So where does Jude come into all this? She's on a commission from an SA Mill website. She signs up students who are having problems. You being one of them. Last semester, I was up against a load of tight deadlines. It seemed like an easy way out. I don't get it, though. If you're one of her customers, why would she blackmail you? A few weeks ago, she said she'd go to the head of department and tell her about my fake essay if I didn't go out with her. A bit risky. Wouldn't she be exposing herself as well? You don't know Jude. She can be a very convincing liar. It's not like I have a choice. Of course you do. Stand up to her. How? Blackmailers need secrets. If you take away the secret, then she has nothing. That's not quite true. What else? <laughs> this is embarrassing. <laughs> it's like I wonder all the time. I don't really like her, you know? Yeah, I get it, get it. Preaching to the choir. It's just such a mess. And what about Polly? I've blown that, haven't I? I really like her, but this whole thing with Jude happened and I got a bit lost. So what are you going to do about it? I don't know. Well, if you want my opinion... Go on. You could either... Stay with Jude in your weird psychosexual compulsion, buying your way to a degree. Or you could come clean, ask for forgiveness, and be a better person. You make it sound so sus. And God knows what Polly's going to think about all this. Okay, it's not going to be easy. But what choice do you really have? I think she's meeting Jude. <laughs>
at the Union Bar if you want to catch her. Sorry, Tom, I've got to get back for afternoon surgery. It's okay, thanks. Oh, and you won't tell me mum and dad about this, will you? Oh, no, of course not. Definitely not. <laughs> Patient confidentiality. Let me know how you get on.